good day guys welcome back to the channel this is a very different video for me because this is my first ever vlog I'm not sitting in front of a computer today uh, I'm actually sitting in front or standing in front of Sydney Harbour so we just got here last night we got here about 2 in the morning roughly I'll put a video up for you guys so you can see it was a, such a beautiful sight to behold when we came in this morning um, but yeah if you don't know I am actually an employee of Royal Caribbean so I'm currently standing on the ovation of the seas which is the biggest cruise ship to ever sail out of Australia. Um, so I'm here for about three more weeks, but I thought I'd get, put a video, few videos for you guys to see what sort of uh, my life is like on here. Because um, I am a musician, I play trombone in the orchestra, so I'll show you a bit of that. But today, we're in Sydney, so I'm going to head down there, get some breakfast, and then I'll catch up with you guys. down on land down so today we're actually starting a three-day cruise which is very uncommon for this sort of ship uh, we've been mostly doing nine and ten day cruises normally to New Zealand uh, but it's a three-day cruise today starting tonight uh, I think it's mostly targeted at people who really haven't cruised before so they're people who want to see like what cruising is like come for three days or so um, so it'll be a very short cruise but I'm gonna vlog the whole thing and see what you guys think um, I think it's a perfect opportunity to do the first vlog to, uh, to see what you guys want to see, really. So at this point, I was really hungry, so I just made my way over to Macca's just to get a quick bite to eat. Had my healthy breakfast, got my coffee, perfect start to the day. So unfortunately, I kind of missed the deadline for breakfast on the ship. Uh, normally, I do have breakfast on the ship because that's the only option. Uh, but that's only open until about 9, 9.30ish, so I kind of missed the deadline there. So I had some Macca's. And now I'm actually heading to the library, the United State Library, to upload YouTube videos and also download videos that I can watch myself. Because uh, there is Wi-Fi on the ship, but it's we've sort of had limited access, so that's why I head to the library. There's free unlimited Wi-Fi where I can upload videos for you guys to watch.
now raining. My day's been ruined. Nah, to be honest, I haven't been here in like 10 years, like when I was a kid. And there's so much here, like I'm not going to be able to see everything in the time I have. I've about two hours here, but I'll see what I can get to for you guys. I've got to get back on the ship now, as you can see in the distance there. Uh, I've got about two hours, I think, until my rehearsal, so I'm just going to chill until then. I won't be able to film how I get on the ship because there's a lot of security and stuff. But I'll catch up with you guys in a minute.
and the shows are all done for the night. We had two shows actually, 7.30 and 9.30, but we really only play for like five minutes, 10 minutes for these opening shows. Uh, they're mostly, the main event is the comedians that you're normally that we have on. Um, so my night's done, I'm heading to the bar. The crew bar here is really good. Beers are $2, the whiskeys are $2.50, the, uh, the wine is uh, like $9 a bottle, really nice. But I'm gonna have a, sh I'm gonna have a shower and then head over to the bar. day cruise so we're currently at sea we're at sea for the next two days before we get back to Sydney on Monday I believe today's Saturday we're currently at the very top of the ship I'm on deck 15 there's 16 decks on the ship just passing the, uh, the surfing station there um, yeah it's a massive ship so it's a quantum class ship which is the third biggest size they have but yes yeah, I think I said yesterday it's the biggest ship that sails out of Australia the ovation um, but we're, it's actually going to go to America in a few weeks, but that's when I'm, I'm going to be leaving the ship. Um, but yeah, so we're here, for, I'm here for another few weeks, but I'm going to be walking and talking for a bit as we walk past the rock climbing wall here. Um, yeah, a few fun facts about the ship. So there's about, well, you can usually fit about 5,000 passengers and then about 1,500 crew members. So obviously I'm one of the crew members and being a musician we get privileges that most crew members don't get like we're able to go on here on the running track we're able to use the guest gym um, because the crew gym is alright but it's a lot smaller there's the penders here 
Um, yeah, Royal Caribbean's big on art as well. They, they, they've got all sorts of art around the ship and outside as well. Um, yeah, 5,000 guests, most crews. So there's 5,000 people came on yesterday. And yeah, 1,500 crew, member, for crew members. The ship is about uh, 1,100 feet long, I believe. And then as heavy as you can think, really. It's a very heavy ship, of course. Um, yeah, so the sea days for me, they're pretty chill during the day. I've got shows, I've got, we've got two shows tonight with the, uh, with the singers and dancers. It's sort of like a burlesque Las Vegas show, so, um, but it's pretty fun to play. Um, and we're doing that tomorrow night as well. We're doing two shows tonight and one show tomorrow night, and that's literally all I have to do for the rest of the cruise. So at the moment I'm just walking, getting some fresh air, all the way up there. That's the North Star, so that's sort of the viewing point. People can go up there and get a view of the ocean, or if we're at a port, they can the port. The pool down there, you can see. So there's three pools here. That's the outdoor pool. There's also two indoor pools. One of them is like a family-friendly one, and the other one is just for adults, really. Um, there's also you know bars scattered everywhere. People buying drinks. Uh, but it's a great, it's a great um, time to spend a weekend, really, because. This crew started yesterday on Friday and they'll come back on Monday so they get to, get to stay here for the whole weekend, which is pretty good if you ask me. There's another view of the pool. Um, yeah, hopefully it's not too windy for you guys, by the way. Um, yeah, I'm literally chilling for the whole day. I'll probably go to the gym later. Uh, I'll do some more video editing, I think, and read, read my book for a bit. And then our shows tonight, they're up till like 7.30 and 9.30, so I've got like eight hours until then, so... We're chilling. Alright, it's about 5 pm, it is gym time. So I normally go like four, three or four times a week, and I normally go around this time because it's not as busy because it's a big gym, um, but it holds 5,000 people obviously. So. Uh, it's not as busy at this time of day. So for this show, we're actually hidden behind a curtain for about 90% of it, I'd say. So most of the time the audience doesn't actually see us, they hear us fine, but they don't see us. Uh, we are on a, band, a moving band cart that moves quite a bit during the show, and it's quite big, so it does get in the way of the dancers and singers, and well, because it's a band cart, it's a cart, it has to stay on the stage the whole time. But yeah, because it can get in the way, we really just stay at the back most of the time, we only come out uh, at certain points during the show. So this is around the middle of the show, we get shown off with uh, one of the singers here in a chart called Burning Up, so we get smoke thrown in our faces and yeah we get to play right uh, at the front of the stage, which is a rarity for us in this show.
And so concludes day two. So we have the exact same show on day three the next day. Just one, just the one show. We had two uh, tonight. But I headed to the bar, got a few drinks, played a bit of pool, played a bit of table tennis, but then I uh, headed back to bed. Did a little bit of video editing, some war stuff um, by plugging my laptop into the TV. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for day two. We'll see you on day three. All right, it is now day three. It's the last day of the cruise, which is crazy. The shortest cruise we've had, um, apart from this one, was like eight days. So we're going to be back in Sydney tomorrow, which is awesome. Um, but yeah, I had a massive sleep in. I woke up at like 11. Um, so it's been a pretty chill day for me. Been doing quite a bit of video editing. Just got back from the gym, but I thought today I'd show you guys around my cabin because uh, I know I haven't shown you guys that yet. So let's see. All right, here we are. That's my room here. I'm on deck number six, four, six, double O three, one person. So it says one person, but it's actually a single share. So what a single share is, is you have your own room, but you actually share a bathroom. So this is a very tiny room. That's it. That's all I've got. <laughs> So, yeah, it's pretty small, but, um, uh, yeah, it's, it does the trick, right? So, the bed's here, pull this down every night to sleep on it, uh, and then I've got a pretty nice desk. Um, so, most of the crew do live in, in double rooms, so they have a roommate uh, that they have bunk beds with. So, it's good. This, the, all the musicians have single shares, which is great. So, it um, means you have your own room, essentially, so which is great. Uh, and so the only the the share part means you share a bathroom. So the bathroom is in there. So I share with my roommate on the other side. So here's basically a mirror ring room to this. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys around. So uh, this number is actually the number of days I have left until I leave, which is great. So just under three weeks. Um, there's a few magnets from where we've been to New Zealand. I've got bathroom towel. I've got my suit here. This is a little. This is a really nice um, magnetic. The whole wall is magnetic, by the way. Um, and not just the door, the whole wall's magnetic. Um, just a little nice place to keep my like my wallet, my watch, my name tag there, uh, and the remote as well for the TV. The TV's there, uh, which is uh, what I use to... Um, I can plug my laptop into the TV if I want to watch videos on there, which is great. Um, yeah, uh, down here I've got like coffee, water bottle, um, yeah, coffee mug, some card games. Uh, there's some lens cleaner for my glasses, got some pre-workout for the gym, got my notebook there for writing shit down, got my charges there, got my switch back there, got my laptop here, I'm just watching some Australian football at the moment, uh, I've muted it though, I normally have the sound on, uh, I've got some spare linen and towels and stuff, another water bottle there, in here, this is all the wardrobe space I have really, so pretty much all of my clothes are in here, not my shirts, shorts, pants, shoes down there, um, I've got some underwear in there as well and then this drawer is for like just spare stuff really and tires and spare charges and stuff got all my bags down there uh, there's a life jacket in the corner and there's then here there's also not much storage space here so the really the downside of these single shares is that they really don't have much storage space at all compared to the double rooms the double rooms have quite a bit more storage space uh, but I've made it work for the last few months and then in um, here's a little bathroom cabinet so I've got my toothbrush some you know, hair products, some combs and floss and stuff like that. But that's pretty much it. Like, that's the whole room. So, uh, yeah, I thought I could show you guys around. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments. Um, but, yeah, that's that's pretty much what I've been what I've been living in for the last three months or so. All right, that is going to conclude my very first vlog. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know what you liked, also what you want to see in the next, in a future one. Um, yeah, it's the first sort of video I've ever done like this. So, um definitely want to see what you guys want to see but that's going to do it for me today guys really hope you enjoyed i'm definitely looking forward to posting another one in the future um, but until then peace out guys Dead.